Hello everyone. Uh, welcome on my channel. Uh, in this video, I am going to share one of my writing essays that got banned 8.5 from the uh, IELTS examiner. Uh, I'm really glad to share this sample answer with you. As I had uh, got band eight in my real test and these days I am, uh, let's say, uh, trying my best to get band nine. So I decided to, uh, uh, let's say, uh, check my essay with the examiner, X IELTS examiner. And this essay is uh, discussion plus opinion. And the essay is from Cambridge book number 12. And it is for both academic and general training. Uh, as the examiner is Mike Whitey, and he charges $5 for each tax correction. Uh, okay. So I'm going to share uh, the essay with you. Here is the essay. And I wrote this essay on, 20, on 2nd February 2020. And the question says, uh, some people believe that it is good to share as much as information as possible in scientific research business and academic world. Others believe that some information is too important or too valuable to be shared freely. Discuss both views and give your own opinion. Please look at the first side of the question. It says we should share information as much as possible. Other side says it is too important or too valuable to share freely. It shouldn't be shared freely. And here discuss both views. Our job is to discuss both views and give our own opinion. So then I have decided to make a plan within three or four minutes. Planning why share much information freely. People become familiar and updated. One main point. And the disparity between countries decreases. And another point for why share much information freely. And another one, I have also made two supporting points. Why not share information freely? It can be misused and it may be less valuable. Now let's look at the uh, question. It may, it may be misused and it may be le less valuable. Now let's paraphrase the question. Look at the first sentence of my essay. Uh, one of the hotly debated issues is where the sharing information, uh, sharing abundant information related to scientific research, trade and education freely is advantageous or not? Look at the question, is it advantageous or not? These are the main opposing views. This essay discusses both sides of the argument and why I believe that sharing much information free of cost is the best idea. I have supported the first side. Now I'm going to talk about the side that I have not supported in the introduction or in my opinion, okay? People who are against sharing, invalu sharing invaluable information freely believe that the information can be disastrous if misused and less valuable. Look here, the supporting point. One, it can be disastrous if misused and it can be less valuable. At first, the discovery of anything may be misused. For example, Scientific inventions such as bombs and missiles can be mishandled if everybody knows 
how to produce such mass destructive weapons. As a result, the entire world may suffer from terrorism and it will meet a sad end. I have fully explained my first supporting point with an explanation, example and result. As well as this, look, this is linking phrase at first, then as well as this, if information is shared free of cost, it may lose its importance. It may lose its importance. How? It means that finding new discoveries not only takes a lot of time of the researchers, but also requires a large budget of the governments. Therefore, people may give less importance to new discoveries if they get information without a cost. Look here, the explanation and the result. Now I'm going to contradict from the first point, or from the first body, the first word is nonetheless. So it contradicts from the first body. The proponents of sharing must of the information freely believe that the entire people will be advanced as well as the gap among countries may decline in scientific discovery, business and educational sector. Let's look at the entire people will be advanced and know the, the gap among countries may decline. Firstly, here I have used firstly to get more in coherence and cohesion. I'm going to order, I'm going to write in a chronological order. Firstly, if more information related to these fields is shared freely, everybody will get a chance to learn various ideas about them and can be familiar and updated with scientific research, trade and academic world. Look the explanation, how it has been explained. In addition, now firstly after in addition, the disparity between countries may be less if more information in these sectors is shared. How? This is because all nations may look equally advanced and they may treat each other in a respectful manner. Look here, how they may look each other in a respectful manner. So now I'm going to recap what I said. In conclusion, I believe that both sides of the argument have merits. However, from my perspective, more and more information should be shared freely. Why? Because it may advance people in these sectors and lessen the gap between countries. So look the opinion here. I have supported and explained why I supported this. So the number of words in this essay is 313. This is this essay has got banned 8.5, as I have said. I am the IELTS trainer at Bali and Birkut International Consultancy Bagbaza Kathmandu. Uh, so here is Think IELTS, Think Valley, and the area also important note for you. This document cannot be reproduced in any form whatsoever in print or electronic. Please just look at the question and just write each of these sentences step by step. And show this essay to your IELTS instructor and ask him how much band score he or she gives in this essay okay i hope this lesson has been very helpful and supportive in your ielts preparation 
therefore i would like to hotly request you to subscribe my channel and leave your valuable comments as well as please do not forget to share these videos among your friends and don't like to forget your let's say one subscription and like and share gives me a lot of energy so that i can make more videos in the days ahead at the last or at the end i will wish you all the best stay safe have a great preparation and have a great luck bye bye and see you in the next video